At first glance, you'd think there's been a chemical spill in the building. In reality, it's a hazardous waste operations class, suited up for a training exercise. This class is for people that might work at contaminated properties and uh, trying to prepare them to wear personal protective equipment and, and know how to use it. Students split into groups with one at a command post documenting everything. Another goes in with radios and air monitoring instruments. They take readings near the waste drums to see if there's any vapors or hazards in the area. The entire exercise, from the monitoring to the air purifying respirators, can be an adventure for students. Probably just suiting up. Uh, we've also done some air monitoring labs and things. And all that's pretty nice. The training is required for anyone who must go into a contaminated site. For instance, the oil spill in the Gulf. Workers dealing directly with the crude oil had to be certified in the same training. The class is part of environmental science, safety, and health. Students here go on to careers ranging from land use planning to environmental site assessors and underground storage technicians. It's, it's fun. People, uh, students tend to enjoy it, and I think it's a, uh, they, there's a big benefit that Columbus State offers this training, and, uh, especially when it comes to students actually getting a job. 